Mr. Bonnie Johnson, this time maybe I'll do a PS from KDU Global. Yes. First of all, I want to say thank you, thank you for the way, for way you allow me for honor you today now the Black now Black History celebration. Thank you very and much. We are so we're so happy to get you and for you accept the invitation for do this for me. Because that's some told they do every year and the name come up. Um, I guess you the people then they we don't really really play, listen to you music and I will, I go on live I see how 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 powerful you are in the jazz business. <laughs> so so you really you are the best person for do this for real. We thank we tell we tell you thank you. Okay. I get a few questions there for ask you. We um how this jazz business, how you start up, how you start for do this this music thing. Yes, as a very young man, young, a very young boy, um, music attracts me in a church. I will always tell me that I want to play organ because we pew in Beniza church, we uh -huh. just don't play the organ. So I tell uh -huh. me that we always look for good church just for you the organ. But then in those days, you know, get organ holes and they can't pay for you for go take music lessons. So my brother Donald, him in the high school band with my grandpa, trumpet be the house. He always they can host with the trumpet. So I said, well, if organ not in the house, let's start with the trumpet. So my brother begin to teach me. He teach me how to play the trumpet. He introduced me and came me go high school band. I begin playing a high school band, play for church, hymns, burial, Thanksgiving. But then the, the trumpet so attracts me, like I fall in love with the trumpet. Oh. I, I, I tell myself, say, there's more than I can play than for play hymns and matches and burial. So I begin play hymns them and gospel and jazz and listen to radio. I can the work on a treat, I sit on table, I go buy them, I buy record them, I can also practice. Then a friend of mine say, why not go Lagunda? Lagunda, they get dance bad. The way yes. you want to meet you, then go accommodate you, then go play. So I take my friend in advice. I go meet one man, Mr. Andrew Williams, then I've been the band leader of Sierra Freak. Uh -huh. So I tell us, I want to play trumpet, I want to play jazz, I want to play all this dance band music. Oh, the man was so open to welcome me. Oh. Because in those days, I mean, young people, you know, they make that kind of advice. Yes, 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 yes. So they begin so that's great. Me. Yes, they begin to teach me, begin to practice with me and show me the things they were for learn. And at that time, they have been the go school or the high school, they from four, from five. So it so consume me that I dedicate all my time to this trumpet. Oh, my granny can the vex, so I can the play the holes. He said, I didn't make noise. He said, I don't bear full. Like, they say, I don't eat gary, I don't bear full. But they don't know, say, I will get a vision, man, for take this trumpet beyond the holes, beyond Sierra Leone, and all of that. So I can even invite me party then at school. I said, when I come, uh -huh. they play, when I come here, here, they were so surprised. They said, but in our work, you don't get so for life. Even if you oh. left now, you don't get work. Yes, but they yes. Give me time to all of that and practice, 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 and practice, and practice. Because in those days, we not get music shop, we not get an um, orchestra, we not get anything for buying. So I spent a lot of time listening to such more Miles Davis, all them jazz musicians, at the fan record and at on table, they practice, practice, practice. Man, I practiced a uh, man when I begin play. People were very, very, very supportive and appreciative. Say, wow, you bring a new sound. Even while I go to church, I begin play jazz and I been in the church. I be I carry the music, go all side where they go. So oh, um, that that's that's the passion I have. That's the passion I had when I was a boy and still, still at this well, stage. Still, yeah, well, you yeah. can see that that pays off. I mean, practice makes perfect. That's why you're yeah. so, so good, you know? Well, I, well, well uh, I can tell me, my students and colleagues, and say, practice makes perfect if you yeah. practice perfectly. That's true. That is, practice that is so true. Practice makes progress. I tell them, say, practice makes progress. Uh -huh. So the more you practice, the more you get better at what you do. The more you practice, the more you get better. Yes, yes, so just yes. Practice makes perfect. You just sit down. You get for no waiting for practice. When for practice? How for practice? That's the steps to a perfect practice. Yes, you're so right. So basically, which I understand from what you say, now the church and your brother really motivates you and put you into this, right? You all the give you all the um the attention and make you able for for work on that more until you become so perfect and able for for 
for into for get other people them involved and be so so I mean you like I said you not you so good in that and I can tell you saying that because you don't practice endlessly and it's your passion you want for do I am for be better in them and you can tell the result the result is it's outstanding so yes so, in, in, yeah. in those days music changed my life music music gave me confidence music gave me self worth music helped me for generate income at that early age i yeah. knew the power because i because the very lagunda nightclub will be in the play 18 years old we are not allowed into the nightclub i was just 14 years old playing in a nightclub that 18 years old we are not allowed that tells me something that excellence defies protocol when yes. you're good at what you do in uh -huh. the price protocol well you see why we select you for this category of music <laughs> we really go back and get the right person we don't get no doubt about the music <laughs> how you started and who's how you don't did today now yes. for waiting i me feel to say based on what you tell me now your brother and the church motivates you you want to add anything to that where you get who's how you get your motivation for well, I, 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 I fall in love with church music. My my aim was to be an organist, play in church, but then I needed to play an instrument. So my brother was there to teach me, and eventually I became an, a conductor in the church. I was so invested in church music. I trained choirs and choristers and musicians, even like working with Balanta Academy in Freetown to help people I mean, not sure their musical dreams. So yes, the church helped me and also Donald, my brother, at Methodist Boys High School Band. Okay, so your vision, your vision really is for other people for work with you and be and able for play the same music way they play and let it improve based but on which the vision. The oh. vision, I, I get a vision for train music yes. teachers, especially teachers in Sierra Leone, because if the teachers are not equipped, the students will not be equipped. So you therefore make sure so you bring the teachers at a certain level, give them the right resources, the right attitude towards music in the classroom. And then the students will fall in love with the subject because the teachers have become ambassadors of yes. the discipline. Yes. The students have to see the passion in the teacher and then that passion will rub on to the students. Yes, yes. That brings me to the next question. Now, what can you do for pass this music to the next generation? Well, I, I have taken my music globally because um, after I left Milton Magai, I go to the Royal Academy in Scotland. I get a scholarship for doing master's course. So I teach in okay. Scotland, I teach in England, I teach in Egypt, I teach in Qatar, oh. I teach in Dubai, and now I, where I can make a so, I work with the District of Columbia Public Schools doing professional development for teachers. I work with the Montgomery County Public Schools, and now I'm teaching in, in an independent school in America, just so that the next generation will be equipped with musical skills. That's why I thank God. God gave me the ability for play as many instruments as my hands can handle because not to all picking go like trumpet not no, to all no. picking go like piano so in yeah. the classroom i go teach guitar i go teach saxophone i go teach piano i go teach bata i go teach ukulele i go teach bass guitar so that picking them will be very equipped for nurture them passion so even talking about what they do for the next generation i even don't produce a a, a, a piano book for Piquet, oh, so that okay. Piquet then go able have fun. This book is for children to have fun while playing an instrument. So this is just the first publication of many books. I'm thinking of writing for trumpet. I'm thinking for writing for guitar. Even their parents who've asked me, why not do a book with Piquet then go play Christian music, gospel songs, praise and worship, picking the way common at Christian homes. So they go notch that kind of musical styles in their musical knowledge. So that's the vision I have yeah. to equip the next generation. Generation. Yes. That is that is so good. Any any possibility you think about Salon Picking the 
the local one day, one day, go just say like go salon, go teach them some of this. You get your vision over there, get them do the same to it till they do so. Like, try yes. to teach. One yeah, thing, yeah. one thing I've started. You want to get the opportunity for, I mean, for tap into your knowledge, you know. So any that anything we would think think of in the ne near future or the yes. late future. We 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 I I have made so many too many plans to go to Freetown, but then you get the Ebola, you get the yeah COVID, yeah you know, yeah yeah. yeah. Wait till they do so where well they are right now. I am documenting Sierra Leonean folk songs in a music format because I know say most of the Sierra Leonean picking there were born Naya, we're born overseas, they have no connection with the music back home. Yes. So yes. if they can sing or read fire fire um, 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 and then shout the way we granic in the sing, tell them thank you, all them custom, custom, all them kind.